Hey everyone, welcome back. Hey and happy Pride everyone. Happy Pride. Today we're going to the Pride Parade here in Portland. You're excited? I am excited because this is the first time we're going to a Pride Parade together. Oh yeah, it is our first one. It is the first time. Because you've only so, been to the ones in Brazil. I've only been to two Pride Parades in Brazil and I want to see the difference between the parades in Brazil and the parades here in the US. Yeah, and I've only been to the ones in Orlando, which is why I'm wearing Orlando United for Pulse. That's cute. The anniversary. And yours? And I'm wearing our Pride Can you show? Oh, tank wait. top. Oh. It's a new tank top. <laughs> I was on the <laughs> tip of my toes trying to sh show it. A little, show it. <laughs> a little birthday cake. We yeah, got it. so there is the there are the rainbow colors. And it's like a step. Yeah, right here. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. I like it. But before we go to the streets, we'd like to say that this video is being sponsored by Wix. We would like to say thank you, Wix, for believing in equality and for sponsoring our Pride video. Wix is a free platform where you can build the website you've always wanted. And you don't have to be an expert in computers to build one because it's simple and fast. Wix gives you a lot of design possibilities. If you can think of something, Wix probably has it. This makes each website personal, unique, and original. With Wix, you can create a website for anything. If you want to have an online business, a personal brand, or just have a place to be creative. Let me take you behind the scenes of our site. Now, updating a page is very fast. Finally, we have our Patreon page, so we wanted to put the information on our website. Now to do this, I changed the title, I added the text, I put in the link, I changed the color to make it stand out and make it a little bigger, and I hit update. It's that fast. Here is our website. We've updated a lot of it as you can see. We changed the picture, we updated our merchandise with our new hats, and this is the one that I'm wearing in the video, and our pride gear. And you will see Bernardo is wearing this shirt in our video. If you would like to build your own free website, you can go to www.wix.com slash go slash steps of two foreigners or you can click on the link in the description below. Bernardo! What? Are you ready? Let's go. Time for the parade. It's gonna be fun. No, yeah, it'll be fun. The Orlando one it was really cool. Yeah? Yeah. that we're able to come to these pride parades. Oh, for sure. And here in Portland, I think it's a little bit more special because people are so, they accept everyone. Yeah, it feels like you can be who you really are here. Yeah. And people are not gonna judge you. That's why we love Portland. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a good place. We should ride there. Maybe not. You should. <laughs> <laughs> not today. But you fell off the bike, so... That doesn't mean I'm gonna fall off a scooter. I don't know. <laughs> <Come on. laughs> a scooter's easy. It's 
not easy. Of course it is. It's much easier than a bike. You don't know. I know, I've been on the scooter. Now we're going to a little block. A little block party. Block party, that's how you call it. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully we can find a place that we'll dance there. I think they have music there. Let's be so. fun. The city is full. Everyone is out on the streets. You wanna go dance? Yeah. There's a line. Let's go to the line. Yeah, we gotta wait. Don't you wanna wait? What? Oh, you wanna wait? Yeah. Alright. Okay. Fun. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> it was a little unexpected. Yeah. I didn't expect to have this much fun. Yeah, me too. The parade was cool and the little dancing was cool. It was cool. I can remember the last time we did this. We danced. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's been a long time. It's been a long time. What, since Brazil? It was in Brazil. Yeah, because my legs are tired. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because you're old. I'm not old. We haven't sure. danced like this. I like to dance like this. <laughs> But you're the old one, you're like, no, I don't want to go out. <laughs> don't. <laughs> you're lying. I'm just <laughs> kidding. You're snarling me. But we should do this more often. You go up. When I go down. And you say clear. When I go blind. When I fall hard. You turn me around. And oh, I hope you always be around the show. completely different and it's com completely different from the image that I think most people have about the the pride parade how so because well if you're expecting shirtless muscular guys mm -hmm. in the pride parade don't come to Portland <laughs> oh, yeah Portland <laughs> that, didn't have that yeah that's not exactly what you're gonna find here yeah actually I didn't see one single muscular guy shirtless there was, a, there was one on the truck. He was on the YMCA truck, remember? Excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> well, in, in Brazil and, and I think in many other parts of the world, in the Pride Parade there are like lots of guys, shirtless, yeah. a lot of electronic music, and that's not quite what happens here. Mm -hmm. And 
here you can see there's more more of a political approach yeah I think yeah I would say that yeah and you can see people from all ages uh, in the parade and I thought that was really cool like seeing older straight couples uh, cheering uh, for for the people who were in the parade yeah they were and, it felt like they were just coming to support yeah and you could could see yeah. in their faces like their expression like they were really supporting and they were really like feeling proud and yeah I really enjoyed there were a lot of kids that. there too a lot of kids a lot of straight couples it wasn't just gay people yeah right a lot of straight people there supporting the cause yeah I agree and it feels like everyone there they were aware of what they were supporting yeah so I agree I like that and and uh, one difference I know would be the drinking because in Brazil uh, I know you can drink yeah. that's another difference in Brazil you can drink on the streets and here in the US you can't so I think people in Brazil they get a little bit more excited. So oh yeah, there's alcohol involved. So yeah, so there's a lot of dancing, a lot of kissing, and yeah, a lot of everything. <laughs> Not here. Not here. Here is a lot of supporting. Yeah, there was a there were many families. Yeah, both yeah. both are supporting. It's just supporting in different ways. In different ways, yes. Yeah. And what about you? What did you think of the parade? So I was I was really impressed, especially because I had only been to the one in Orlando, and I think if everyone could come and see the support that people from Portland or from Oregon came, I think you might think homosexuality in a different way, mm -hmm. because I saw a sign that said uh, "Never apologize for someone you love," and when I saw that sign, I remember I said, "Oh, look at that sign! That's a good sign." Yeah, that caught your attention. Yeah. And because I was really paying attention to the signs because I like to see what people say. And there were many signs. Yeah, it was really good to yeah. see. But then, so I, I started thinking, never apologize for someone you love. But I know growing up young and being gay, we were apologizing for who we were. I know whenever I called my parents, I was crying and I said, oh, I'm sorry, I'm gay. But mm -hmm. we apologize for who we were or who yeah. we are. Mm -hmm. And so I think many many people do that. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, the first thing, their first reaction is to apologize right. once they're out of the closet. So. Because for us, we I mean we felt bad for being gay. Mm -hmm. I I thought it was a sin. You just thought it was wrong. Yeah, in my family, it wasn't much about religion. It was much more about like uh, common sense mm -hmm. and ignorance. That's yeah. the right word. So yeah, it's kind of hard to grow up feeling proud right. of who you are when you when you hear like friends, people at your school, people in your family yeah. talking bad things about being gay. So yeah, it's challenging to feel proud uh, proud of who you are. Yeah, especially young, especially when, when you're growing young. up. It was really hard. It is hard. And being gay and you know, growing up, it was hard for for the both of us. Mm -hmm. And I mean, the only thing if you're going through this, and I mean, it's gonna be hard. But I mean, look how proud we are now. Mm -hmm. I think I can say, like, I I'm really proud to say I'm you know I'm gay. Nowadays, and, I don't care. Yeah, I, I really feel proud of. Same here. I don't care. I, I feel proud of showing our love, mm -hmm. and I feel proud for supporting other gays and. Yes, I, I remember when I was 19, the first time when, when I went to a gay club mm -hmm. and I felt so scared yeah. and so embarrassed uh -huh. and I didn't be, I didn't want anyone to relate me to that because I felt it was something wrong. Did you wear a hat? I, I did. Yeah, I my did. first wore <laughs> You did like, too? I'm <laughs> going to my first gay club. <laughs> yeah, and that's because I wasn't proud of myself. Well, yeah, yeah. I didn't want to be related to that, so I felt really proud this time. Yeah, I yeah, for the past years, I don't know, maybe five years, I've been feeling really proud yeah. about my who, who I am. Yeah, I agree. And I think the same for you. For sure. Remember to go out, be proud, and make memories. <laughs> and we would also like to say, like, 
it's a really nice feeling to be able to hold hands, to kiss, and we all know that we're able to do this because of the generations before us who fought for our rights. It hasn't always been like this. Right. The gay pride parades, they started like for a reason. Yeah, that's true. Right? And, and it's, just a, it's just a good feeling to have. Yeah. Nowadays, we can march you know, freely. Mm -hmm. Yeah, without anything. We happening. still have a lot to accomplish. I agree. But yes, we're here because of the older generation. Because so, of everything they fought for. So thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Happy Pride. Happy Pride. Yeah. Next year? Next year, San Francisco. I'm not sure. Why not? <laughs> uh, Tel Aviv. <laughs> oh, Tel Aviv. Tel Aviv would be cool. Oh my god. Yeah. Who knows? Mm. Stood. Ciao. Ciao, Max. Nice.